this uh, tutorial is really about um, libraries and how do you store uh, or create a texture library. So last week I've asked everyone to um, photograph texture that they like when they come across either in the house or outside. Um, an example of those textures uh, were trees, tree barks, um, leaves, concrete, um, anything that actually that creates a really interesting texture that you can potentially use it in your photograph or uh, what I like to do is I use it as textures for backgrounds so instead of buying really expensive um, backdrops right uh, I apply these texture to it uh, when I'm taking portraits uh, there's two ways the easiest way is just to create a photo um, a texture library in your computer or on a hard drive um, or and then just say Adobe texture and then import all that textures into it um, or the other way is do it directly in Photoshop so what you want to do is open up Photoshop go up to Windows open your libraries and then from here uh, you want to create a new group so we're going to click here we're going to create a new group of library and I'm going to name it texture <clears throat> then I'm going to drag all those texture into hat. So it's going to take a while for it to import. And there you have it. You just imported um, all the textures that you have um, <clears throat> into a library. So now uh, whenever you need to use the a certain texture again just go to libraries and then you can pull it up and then just drag it onto your uh, canvas so please go ahead and do that and put all the textures that you created and if you didn't do the homework I would suggest that you take your time uh, before going to completing the other parts of the assignment is go out uh, outside or inside the house and take at least three or four different textures